Hello and welcome to oxinabox.co.uk and that's The Weekend Sorted, your essential guide to the best food and entertainment that Oxfordshire has to offer. First this week is The Mill in Banbury with Nell Gwynn until Saturday. This deliciously bawdy production is bursting with song and dance. At the Oxford Playhouse, we have Shadows of Troy until Saturday. You can read our review at oxinabox.co.uk. Ardell O'Hanlon is there on Sunday and Puccini's Madame Butterfly is there on Monday. The slightly annoying elephant will be there from Wednesday until Sunday the 23rd. Oxford best-selling author Cara Hunter was presented with an award to mark sales of half a million copies of her book, Close to Home. An evening with Cara is planned in Oxford on March the 3rd. You can read more at oxinabox.co.uk. At the Pegasus, we have the Salt and Port Double Bill by Year One students on Friday and Saturday. Now classical music and Sheku Kane Mason, his sister and brother all perform in the Next Generation series as SJE Arts brings gifted youngsters to Oxford. You can read more at oxinabox.co.uk. Mark Taylor and Gabriella Jones are in Whitney to perform a collection of pieces for the flute and harp on Friday. There is an orchestra of St John's Valentine's Day concert at the Ashmolean on Friday. The Villiers Quartet returns to the Jacqueline Dupre Music Building to perform pieces by Purcell on Saturday. Pianist Tim Horton is at the Hollywell Music Room on Sunday morning and the Atea Quintet is there on Sunday afternoon. Looking ahead now to the festival season, and Cornbury have announced some of their acts this week. These include Jack Savaretti, Dido, Van Morrison and Kid Creole. Endeavour fans have two more episodes to go. Read our very popular interviews with the cast at oxinabox.co.uk. Food now, and why not share the love and treat that special person in your life to a delicious, authentic pizza this week? Find out all about Callum Bourne and the Pizza Pronto story at oxinabox.co.uk. There is a screening of Waiting for Anya, plus Q&A with Michael Morpurgo and Noah Schnapp at the Phoenix Picture House in Oxford this afternoon. At the Cornerstone in Didcot, there is a packed programme, starting with Mark Thomas and 50 Things About Us tonight. Matt Richardson takes the stage with his new show, Imposter, on Saturday, and you can read our interview with Matt online at oxinabox.co.uk. There is also a new exhibition, The Graffiti Generation, which showcases the work of local children from Didcot Girls' School. The Cornerstone Youth Festival runs from Sunday for half term and will include crafts, dancing, theatre, music and art. You can listen to our podcast with the entrepreneurs behind the new gin brand Collagen online at oxinabox.co.uk and Hotter is at the North Wall tomorrow. If you are planning a night or even a weekend of romance, look no further than our roundup of the best places to share with your Valentine. That's it for now. We'll be back next week with more of the best things to do, see and places to eat across Oxfordshire. Check out oxinabox.co.uk for regular updates and fresh content. And please like and share the Oxinabox love across social media. We also have a fantastic weekly newsletter that brings you our top picks. You can sign up online.